What's up everybody, it's Dondria and I'm here at the YouTube space. I'm so excited to be shooting some stuff with YouTube and I wanted to take the time to do my question and answer session with you guys. So a week ago I asked you to ask me any question that you had and that I would be an open book and be completely honest and open with you guys. So let's get started. I got discovered off of YouTube actually and um, it was a really, awesome experience. It was definitely a surprise. I was 19. I definitely didn't think that I would achieve anything other than views on there. I got discovered by Jermaine Dupree, got signed. It was just like, uh, <laughs> okay, well, let's go. Let's do it. After that, I moved to Atlanta. I signed to So So Def, which is Jermaine Dupree's label. I released an album, Dondria vs. Fat Fat. I've been able to go on tour with Trey Songs and Monica. I've traveled all across the world. My favorite place, London, by the way. Hey! Yes, JD is still involved in my career, but I'm taking it more into my own hands now. DMAC and I are no longer together. I know people are gonna be like, oh my God. <laughs> but we're not. We're really, 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 really good friends. I love him to death, but no. It's almost like a complete transformation from when I started to now. Around the time that I got discovered and was putting videos out, I was really like one of the first. So now there's so many people just finding different ways to be creative. It's really inspiring. I mean, even this YouTube space, for us to come here and create and just make amazing content, it's really, really awesome. I do think that signing with Soso Def was a good idea. Having JD as the overseer of everything, it was the best situation for me coming from like a small town and not knowing what the heck is going on. I feel like I was protected from the industry. You haven't heard anything from me lately because honestly I've been just in the grooming phase so I needed to experience life number one, so that I can have content to write about and things that I can actually believe in and portray to you guys. <laughs> abandon is such a harsh word, but why did I abandon my YouTube fans? A lot of things go into that, honestly. All my day ones, you guys can probably remember that my page got shut down at least two to three times. One time somebody hacked it and posted porn or something like that. The week my album came out, my YouTube channel was down. They started getting more strict about like copywriting. You know, I was like the cover queen. Tell So I had to be more selective of the types of things that I posted, but I'm back now. Me and Broadway are still the best of friends. We actually just did a record that you guys will hear later on. I'm really, really excited about that. So no, I did not abandon him. He's doing great. He's still doing music. You can expect my next album very, very soon. You have to know that this is my baby. Dondria vs. Fat Fat was my baby, but my second album will really be like my baby. So stay tuned very, very, very soon. So I just wanna thank you guys. First of all, for all the questions, I hope I answered them. If you have more, feel free to tweet me at Dondria, um, Instagram, Dondria Nicole, Facebook, official Dondria. Also, if you guys have anything that you want me to give you um, as far as content, on YouTube, like what things would you want to see more of me? Let me know that too in the comments. I love you guys. Thank you for everything, and we're just getting started.